seeking approval can be a real thing for a lot of people. So how do we move beyond that to finding affirmations within ourselves? That's what this video is about today. Hi, I'm John of Figurative Arc. I am a visual artist and we're looking at the creative process and how that can enrich your daily life. So approval. I have a cat and cats certainly need approval. And if they could look at social media and scroll doom scroll through there, they would. We look toward other people to please them and that makes us feel good. But but the problem is, what if that calls us to live a life that isn't ours, that isn't authentic? If others around us want us to love a particular kind of person or want to do a particular kind of career, the list goes on and on. That can be very, very difficult because we don't want to disappoint other people. But I would say the bigger issue here is don't disappoint yourself by living a life that someone writes for you. Do your own thing. That doesn't mean to be selfish, but it means that you have to be true to who you are and figure out why you're here and what you have to say and contribute. That can be a hard thing to push back against. So the first thing I would say is really do some soul searching. Look at yourself and find, you know, what what really excites me? What really gets me passionate and focused? So when I'm doing those kind of things, time stands still. And I know I'm in this zone of where I'm supposed to be. Then you develop that and you learn more skills. So if it's like a relationship, then maybe it is you're learning about love languages and how people communicate affection and feelings. Maybe if you're someone like me, like a photographer, you are, are learning by doing and you're sticking to something that you're passionate about, even though other people may not appreciate it or like it. I do male photography. That's not for everybody. So that's what we do is we be true to ourselves. We don't try to do things just to draw attention for the sake of attention. You know, don't create a clickbait video about aliens and cat hybrids, but be authentic, have your skills improve and learn more about where you want to go. And that's not always a straight line that sometimes it seems like we're getting better and then we try something new and then we make a mistake and we go the opposite direction, but have grace and compassion for yourself. Try to find that affirmation of I'm on this path that is mine and I'm going to do that. And that may be hard, but I'm going to have the courage to be myself, to explore who I am and to live that out daily. What's your journey been like? Is that a struggle to live your own life and not seek the approval of others? I'd be interested in hearing your comments below about your journey. If you value content like this, it really helps for my voice to get out to more people. So consider giving a thumbs up and subscribing. So thanks for keeping company with me. Take care, and I hope to see you again. Bye-bye.